Hey, this is Dan, Bob, and Dr. Agro from Gigaboots.com, and welcome to our first impression of the Dragon's Crown trailer from E3 2011. For those who don't know, uh, this is both for the PS3 and the PlayStation Vita. So let's go ahead and start that trailer. This may contain content inappropriate for children. Dragon's Crown. That, that, that was the uh, Odin Sphere people, right? Yes, yeah, Odin Sphere people. Elwhere, and the Muramasa. Muramasa. Yeah. Wow. So yeah, what this game is, is a sort of uh, four-player uh, hack and slashes type deal dungeon crawler where yeah, you can play multiple, multiple different classes. They, this is maybe their first multiplayer game. Yeah, it's their first multiplayer game and it's on both Holy consoles. Holy shit. So you got multiple classes, as you can see here, most of which are hot. <laughs> I uh, elf is a class. <laughs> yeah. Totally is. Um, and so is dwarf. You know, nice. Dwarf's a class. Ah! <laughs> That's just awesome. My fire be burst. So for those who, and then of course, source. I can't talk oh, about oh things God. in the middle of that ridiculousness. <laughs> I wonder what this she is, used her magic on. This is a disturbing <laughs> blend of hyper realism and crazy stylization. Yeah, yeah that's how Odin Fear is, and it's really cool. That's you a know, freaky harpy. Just the this as a PlayStation Vita title is insane. It, yeah, yeah, I. How do you how do you oh, elaborate? It looks like there's some sort of merchant or it's thief following them. Yeah, they got a thief. I guess they haven't announced all the uh, the classes for it. But yeah, uh -huh. this game's being made uh, published by Ignition. Um, yep. God, it it, it 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 like it's a weird mix of uh, romanticism and late medieval. Yeah, that's yeah, that's that's wow. typical of. They usually choose some sort of highly done time period or style and just take their craziness to it and it becomes something yeah, it's, really it's like, interesting. Whichever one of the Monty Python guys did the cartoons just took a lot of acid and got really, really depressed. <laughs> <laughs> and then made the best hack and slash. <laughs> I mean, honestly, having a four-player multi, uh, four-player hack and slash adventure for the PS Vita uh, pretty much at, at yeah, launch, yeah. spring like 2012. Real... That's amazing. Uh -huh. That is a killer. If the play, if the okay, PlayStation spring Portable isn't is really launch, launch, but no, but yeah, but I don't. Yeah, it's still pretty no, sweet. I'm not saying yeah, it's a that launch title, be but sweet. But, yeah, but I know Sony will. They'll be like, that's launch window. But yeah, there's cool. Th that's <laughs> but yeah, no, that's a killer app. And yeah. that's a goddamn killer app. I mean. Judging by their previous history, like Muramasa had really good combat. Exactly. I mean, yeah. Like, yeah. like looking at that, if it were anybody else, I'd think, uh, I think that's going to run kind of slow and clunky. And be gimmicky and not <laughs> but, have a, you know, a fully fleshed out these combat. These fucking system. guys. But it, yeah, they are a trustworthy developer doing. A, 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 it's, I can't. I mean, at the beat I'm him so up, it, was leveling up. It's like uh, freaking treasures. What was that? Legendary Guardians or something? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that thing. Um, I mean, just. This game, it is so much of what I like, all in one tightly giant wrapped. Giant witch tits. Yeah, giant witch. Uh, sorceress. Yeah, sorceress. Sorceress tits. Oh. Total difference there. Gotcha. Completely different. But yeah, just so looking forward to this. Can't wait to hear about more. Uh, we only have about nine months until it comes out, um, or so. So, you know. They better give us another trailer before now. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe TGS will see something more. Yeah, and you know, the the real cool thing, the main reason I'm getting this for Vita is not only the fact that you can get four people around with their own screens and stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have um, to wonder how that'll work. But, but even yeah. better than that, uh, OLED. The OLED screen's going to make that artwork look beautiful mm -hmm. with that really fast response time and beautiful contrast. That's just, the uh, oh, fuck me. <laughs> just goddamn. But yeah, thanks for checking out this uh, gush commentary uh, where we just sit here and praise the game that hasn't even come out uh go check out our much more professional first impressions over at gigaboots.com fun fact that doesn't include the ape escape one that one's, <laughs> i'm just raging it's like a scavenger hunt why did they edit it like that i don't understand <laughs>